Hey you guys, I'm Tom from Mr. Pool Man. Today, I'm gonna to explain basic pool chemistry and why it's important and easy. In this summary, we'll cover the basics you need to know to keep your pool clean and clear. Balancing your pool means keeping the pH of the water between 7.4 and 7.6, which is slightly above neutral on the pH scale. When pH is low, it means your water is acidic. And when it is high, your water is basic. The ideal alkalinity level ranges from 100 to 150 ppm. Alkalinity is a pH buffer, which stops the pH from drastically moving up and down the scale. The ideal calcium hardness level ranges from 175 to 300 ppm. Without calcium, your water will become aggressive and draw the calcium out of your concrete pool's walls and floors. This is commonly mistaken for calcium buildup and incorrectly treated with calcium remover, which makes your pool water even more aggressive. The ideal chlorine levels in a pool range from 1 to 3 ppm. Chlorine is an extremely effective bacteria and algae killer and is very cost effective. Here is a tip, if you start with fresh water or after heavy rain, you might want to add some cyanuric acid so the chlorine doesn't get burned off by the UV rays and retains the chlorine in your pool. Algicide and phosphate removers can be used to kill algae spores before they spread. It can also be used as an ongoing preventative treatment for green pool water. And finally, a water clarifier helps by bonding all those tiny particles so the filter can clean them out. Flock or flocculant is a heavy duty clarifier with an extensive residue. With pool flock, you have to manually vacuum out those particles via the waste setting. This is an advanced technique and should be used with caution. Thanks for tuning in. If you have any questions, please drop us an email to support at mrpoolman.com.au. I'm Tom, happy swimming.